What's up everyone? John Rettinger from Techno Buffalo here. There's been a lot of talk of Flash recently. Not the creepy guy in the park with the trench coat, but the kind of content that you get online. Uh, particularly, there's been a lot of discussion about its lack of device support. Uh, probably most well known to not be present on the iPhone, iPod Touch, or the upcoming iPad. There's been a bit of debate about whether or not Flash is important to have on your device. I'm of the mindset that the consumer should have the choice, and I want to show you some of the benefits that you'll get with Flash 10.1. I am running this here on the Nexus One with the HTC Desire ROM that I demonstrated yesterday. So let me show you what you get um, with Flash. I've got some Flash games queued up here. This is from flashgames247.com. Before I show you how this works, let me show you what Flash content looks like on an unsupported device. Uh, here we've got the iPhone with the sort of notorious blue Lego brick. Um, no Flash content is supported. So go ahead and pick a game. Let's pick Stargazer. I have no idea what that is. Um, connected over Wi-Fi here, so it should be pretty quick. Immediately it starts playing. So I can go... Alright. Alright, so I can go ahead and double click. And it goes into full screen. I can rotate it. And um, if I want to use it this way, it'll look like a little bit better. More suited uh, for this orientation. And you can just start playing. Um, just as you would online. You can get instructions or start. And you've got a lot of options for what you can do here. So this is just a game, for example. Uh, YouTube relies on Flash support, so you can play videos in the browser, and a lot of websites have support for Flash. A lot of advertisements or interactive features uh, are Flash-based. You can actually use those on your mobile device. You know, I think, again, the user should have the option about whether or not they want the extra battery drain that Flash has, um, whether you choose to turn it on or off. I'm not the biggest fan of sort of decisions like that being made for me. Uh, one of the many reasons that I've actually liked being able to have Flash, even just for a day, I found it to be very useful on a lot of different websites. So the big question, guys, is do you think Flash is important on your phone or your mobile device? Do you care or not care? Uh, very curious as to why. Leave a text or a video response. And anyway, guys, I'm John Rettinger from Techno Buffalo. And for all your tech news and create your own tech website and monetize it, uh, be sure to check out technobuffalo.com. And for exclusive content, be sure to check me out at Twitter, twitter.com slash john4lakers. Links, all that will be in the sidebar. I'm John Rettinger, and I will see you in the park.